So part of like a stem of engagement baiting would be copying others. Because here's the thing, people always say to inspire, but don't copy, but there's nuances to this. That's why I put them on two separate tabs rather than like, you know, including it in here. There's a weird thing that you're gonna notice in the VTubing scene is that a lot of VTubers kind of look the same. And it's like, what's up with that? Why do we, why, why, why does everyone look kind of the same? What the heck? And it's because you can't copy something that's generic. For example, I have Z pins on my hair. I noticed that once I started using Z pins, I started seeing other VTubers do it. I'm not the first one to use Z pins, um, but it's a generic like attribute to my model. I don't own Z hair pins. So you'll see a lot of VTubers with Z hair pins because it's a, it's a, it's a generic attribute. You can't like get mad at somebody for copying something that's generic. <laughs> but, 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 you can get mad if they're copying all of your elements and then also trying to just act like you. There's a, there's a big difference between that. So if you're gonna join and become a VTuber, if you wanna be a pink haired cat girl, go ahead. That's a generic attribute. But if you start talking like very low and, kind of slow voice and you specifically copy mannerisms from other VTubers, especially their speech pattern, or you start changing your accent just to match someone. You're kind of towing the line to get slapped across the face and you look like a jerk. Inspire, but don't copy. <laughs> you'll burn a lot less bridges and you'll, you won't have, you won't be damaging your reputation as much.